Welcome everyone to this edition of Looking at Louisville. I'm Chaz. I'm Stacy. And we're here at Proof, which is a restaurant and bar in the 21C Museum Hotel here in downtown Louisville on Main Street. Now you may be asking, why are we here? Why are we here, Stacy? Because, Chaz, we, if you remember, this summer we had a ball out at Freedom Hall yes, filming did. the auditions that came to Louisville, which was one of what, thousands, seven or eight cities. Thousands of people. Mm -hmm. It was with the first stop, I believe. Um, so it was huge. Uh, not only Louisvillians, but uh, plenty of people from around the country came to And they to said Louisville this was one of the audition. biggest audiences that it they had. It was. Remember the energy and excitement of that day? And why we are here at Proof is because this is where the cast from American Idol Simon. Stayed. Paula, Randy. Randy, and even the new girl, Kara. And we're told that this was one of their favorite hangouts here at the Bar at Proof, yeah. which why not? It's on the Urban Bourbon Trail, right? In fact, the hotel was recently named as one of the best in America by Condé Nast Traveler yeah. Magazine. So it's a hot place. We're enjoying it. We're going to have a little dinner in a minute, and uh, we're going to take viewers back um, this summer when we went to see the audition. That's right. Are you ready? Right, I'm ready. Let's, Let's do go. it. <laughs> I'm, I'm one of the unique people, man. I'm one of the only Devin Cates. It's the pink tie! It's the pink tie, baby! <laughs> <laughs> He's like I raise my hands, bow my head, finding more and more truth in the words written in red. Of course, I'm going through the line for American Idol, and who do I see but my niece? who's been singing for years and a few weeks ago I said, Jack, you gotta go in for American Idol. It's, a, it's right here in our own backyard, so how do you feel? I'm great. <laughs> Wonderful, scared, but excited at the same time. Oh, next American Idol. <laughs> She's the next American Idol. Absolutely. Who doesn't long for someone to hold? Who knows how to love you? Without being told, somebody tell me why I'm on my own. If there's a soulmate for everyone. Kara Saban, she's Hi. a producer at Fox um, and kind of in charge of the whole uh, American Idol auditions for Louisville. It's right? been a learning experience. Yeah. It really has. How many people have you seen? Do you think twenty thousand? You know, I. From what, now, I talked to people from American Idol, and San Francisco had 7,500, and they guarantee me we beat that. I, I got a good feeling. I thought we were going to hit the 20,000. Yes, I know. Simon Cowell tells me so. I do think I'm the next American so, Idol. So what's, what's the good up? I'm a zebra. Because? Because I had a dream, and a pack of zebras came to me and told me that I needed to represent them and sing from The Lion King, The Circle of Life. So sing for I can't. I'm saving it for I'm the, the for the American judges. Idol too. She is too. Me I'm too. Saving, I'm saving my voice. I'm glad morning when this life is over. Oh, so, so are you the next American Idol? No, I it's not you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so why are you the next American Idol? She's yes. awesome, you know dog. Sing for me. Right now? Yes, ma'am. Sometimes I get emotional, sometimes I do some stupid things, sometimes I say what I should just keep inside. Who's the next American Idol? <laughs> I'm the next American let me, Idol, let me, that's let me, all it is. Let me hear it, let me hear it. <laughs> because he lives, I can face tomorrow. That's how you get right now. That's how you get. Raise my hands, bow my head, finding more and more truth of the words written in red. <laughs> Well, everyone is moving now into Freedom Hall here in Louisville, Kentucky to go to the next level. Wasn't to it see amazing how long that took to, oh, to get was, through? I mean, it was almost an hour to just get through that line. All those so thousands, people. I mean, thousands of people. This is one, this was a huge mm -hmm. group amount of people. But let, we'll get to that in a second. But let's yeah. talk about what we had to eat here. We had some appetizers. What did we have? Uh, we had the country ham fritters, which are a signature of proof, uh, with the, like a coarse mustard uh, remoulade. And then we had the carpaccio, which they do it a little different here. It's made with Kentucky bison. It's amazing. Now, 
Prior to our big meal, I've got just a green salad here from the Proof Restaurant. And I'm doing a power food. I had the roasted beet salad in front of me. So we're gonna eat this, and while we're eating, we're gonna take you on the post auditions where that's where the people that get through and the people that... Not so much. Yeah, you know. So you're gonna kinda see the inside skinny on what it's happens. great film, great footage. So I think they'll enjoy. We're gonna eat, and you guys can just enjoy what you see. Bon appetit. Yes, enjoy. I'm here with Donovan, and he's from Gallatin, Tennessee. So tell me about your experience, what happened? Um, well, I went through, uh, you know, I sang my song and they just said they wouldn't put anybody through from, from, this, from this round to the next round. So, you know, this is my second time. Just gonna try it again next time around, if there's a next time around. Tell me about your experience here at American Idol and what happened. Well, um, this was definitely an experience of a lifetime. I'm very thankful to be here. And um, I didn't make it, unfortunately, the first round, but I'm gonna come back next year. Tech native, Marcus, and you're from Shepherdsville? Yes. So uh, tell me about your experience, what happened? Uh, I went in there, I sang, I didn't make it, but so many people don't make it anyways. Just but you tried, right? you, gave yeah, it, you gave it your best shot. If you don't try, you never know. I'm here with Bobby and she's from Columbus, Ohio. Tell me about your experience. Um, it was a good experience. I've had a lot of fun. If you don't at least try, you know, you're you going to regret it for the rest of your right, life. So at, at least you gave it a try. Yep, we've had a lot of fun. Of course, I'm here with Kia and you were the very first person to get up and sing and you actually got to go through Yes. to go to the next level of American Idol. So, what's it feel like? What was the uh, the emotions going through? Well, when they first called me, when the very first, when they called me up the same, I was very nervous. So it was kind of, kind of scary for me, but singing is what I do. So the nerves, the jitters, all that just went away when I started singing. Needless to say, I look into the winner's area and who comes out but my bud, Will. So what was it like you got to go through the next round? Cinch. I feel Cinch. the clench. Please, I mean, it's a natural. I mean, I just walked right up and said yes. No, no. It was, it was really, it was really uh, nerve-wracking, and um, I kind of wet myself a little bit, but I'm okay. And um, you got your depends on, right? Yes, of course. Always have my depends on. Now I'm here with Maya, and she came all the way from Mountain View, Arkansas, to participate in American Idol here tryouts here in Louisville, Kentucky. So, what happened? I moved on to the second round. Excellent. Yes. So what did you what did you get to sing? I sang um, an Aretha Franklin song, Sweet Bitter Love. I sang the chorus of that. And then I sang a Ben Harper song um, called Brown Eyed Blue. And then I sang one of mine, which I was really nervous to do, but I did it anyway and it turned out great, obviously. I'm here with Nicholas and he's from Albany, as we call it, right across the bridge from Louisville, Indiana. Now let me do the stuff ladder here, Nicholas. <laughs> now how was it in there? You got to sing uh, for American Idol, the auditions here. I mean, what was it like? What was the vibe? What was the, how did you feel? Well, when I was waiting in line, I was trying to have a good time with my friends and just telling myself the worst that can happen is they say no, just like any other audition. So why not give it a try? Well, welcome back everyone. I hope you enjoyed seeing, you know, all these people out here giving it their heart, their best to try to become the American Idol. Some people made it through to the next level. Some people didn't, but we'll get to that in a second. And for right now, I just finished eating the sea bass, which was incredible here at Proof, which is at the 21C Museum and Hotel. And I'm not finished with my bistro muscles. And yeah, she's got a ton of, fries. look at this, look at this. A ton yeah, of this was the special tonight. It's incredible. It's all good food. It's all good. This so is keep what talking. Paula Abdul ate. Oh, every night. Every night. Every Kara night. and Simon ate, no, I don't know, I don't know what they ate. So what a fun episode, right? Yes, it was. Mm -hmm. You know, it took us well, six months scenes. in the making mm -hmm. to give you an inside skinny before it even hits the air mm -hmm. that you get to see some of these contestants that may, that just one of the contestants could be the Amer next American Idol that came from the Louisville So enjoy Logistics. this season as it starts on the Fox Network. Now, if you have any ideas for any upcoming podcast, please send them to podcast at gotolobal.com. Now, if we use your idea, we'll send you some cool Louisville swag or maybe you can and actually I'll just keep eating and you can just eat, keep eating or maybe we'll send you these empty muscle shells and as always you're looking at Louisville see you real soon hey cheers in fact what are you oh <laughs> There's the blooper. <laughs>